Well, welcome to the 1st of November in 2023. This is a sort of a fast blast update. We're ripping apart the uh, triple edit suite that we've got uh, because we're going to move everything over to one workstation with the possibility of trying to expand our little studio here so it's going to give us a lot more space and more camera angles and things like that. But that's going to take a little bit of planning because it affects audio and audio routing and talk back and a whole lot of other stuff like that. Uh, we'll be covering uh, the, we will be providing the AV services, stage props, and also uh, lighting to uh, Hugh Newman's Origins Conference on the 4th of November. And that's really sort of a run up to bases uh, 2023 on the 9th of December. Uh, and then, of course, you've got uh, Josie's um, conference in Glastonbury the following week. And we'll see about putting those links up. We're also been doing an awful lot of field research with Miriam Yance and those who have been going up on her channel and also on Bases News uh, and also a Bases blog because there's lots of very important information we've been looking at, looking at from different angles, different perceptions, different uh, times about certain facilities and the whole alien presence and what's sort of going on there. Uh, Elena Danan has made it clear about a year ago that there is some kind of a withdrawal, uh, but the Negamac have warned that the Alpha Draconis withdrawal, as to say the Alpha Draconis and the associated races that are allegedly connected with it, or th those races, and including the Greys, have sort of left. Other commentators are saying that the Omega Universe and the Alpha Universe are finally separate, separ separated. So uh, Source and Anti-Source have now separated. Again, there were pointers to this with the late um, Chris Thomas uh, about 10, 20, 10 or 12 years ago, where black holes, which were allegedly detected or seen, they, uh, that's to say negative portal energy uh, has... Um, is being separated. The universe is doing what it needs to to exclude or minimize or re remove those uh, toxic energies and frequencies from this universe, if you get my drift. Now, the caution from the Negamat uh, uh, is, the alarm from the, the Negamat is that the um, Alpha Draconis haven't withdrawn. It's a trick it's the oldest trick in the book from the art of war is you, you fake your withdrawal. Um, there are some indications of human hybrids actually now hatching. Uh, that's to say people having surgery to have their tongue extended or they already have an extended tongue and uh, split like a snake. They're heavily tattooed and different colored skin. There are sort of some signs of that. Uh, but it's just a word of caution that uh, be careful. Anyway, this is the 1st of November. We're working like hell to get Basis TV, more of the uh, material loaded. This is very costly and slow exercise. There are people working very heavily on that. And um, that we're going to be building that up so that the material which is scattered over uh, bases uh, on YouTube, that's bases, the Basis Project Censored, the Basis Project Restricted, and also on Rumble, the Basis Project, and on Brighteon, the Basis Project, and on BitChute, the Basis Project. A lot of that material's up there, has been reloaded, but it's all over the place, it's very difficult to find, and it doesn't make a coherent um, sort of story. And we're working very, very hard to put bases up as available as series. And so you can have a sort of a series link uh, so that you can more, more uh, with a lot more common sense, look at the storyline that these witnesses over the last 25 to 30 years have been giving us. I'll be, I'll be speaking at Bases uh, 2023 Christmas seminars in Pusey, and I'll be talking about the late, the work and uh, the background to the late Lisa McKenna Williams and Barry King is still with us and so is the Reverend Anthony J. Pike and uh, there are people there looking out for James Casbolt who is forbidden to talk to anybody and uh, I think that's about it on the 1st of November. In the meantime we are working behind the scenes, we're trying to build things up, got the car through the MOT today, you know, we did a lot of work on that 
that's a big victory. So on that, we will continue to work hard. We're getting different information saying the same thing about the alien hybrid situation in certain places in uh, parts of England. And uh, I think there's enough said about that than hasn't already been said. So that's it for now.